Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Riser Dawn here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get your hands on the strongest katana in Project Slayers. So this is going to be a fairly short video. Um, I'm just going to show you guys where uh, the boss that you can farm in order to have the highest chance in getting this drop. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Um, and I hope you guys drop a subscribe and like. And let's get right into it. Alright guys, we're back at Butterfly Mansion. Um, this is the closest spawn point area uh, to the boss that we're going to farm in order to get Shinobu's Katana. Now, Shinobu's Katana is the strongest Katana as of right now. I believe it is a mythic drop. Um, and yeah, it's called the Insect Katana. Um, a modified Nichirin Katana designed specifically for piercing demons to, de to deliver poison. Sorry. Um, the item health is times 1.75, meaning that it's gonna uh, have, it's basically the sword with the most HP as of right now, and it gives the most sword damage, plus 5, uh, in comparison to like, the other elemental katanas, which are only plus 3, uh, plus 3, plus 4, which is Giyu's water katana, which is like the second strongest, um, but yeah, so basically, you wanna make your way to Butterfly Mansion, uh, make sure you set your spawn point if you don't have the game pass, um, and all you have to do is come up here, and the boss should be right around this corner. So if you have the game pass, I would recommend that you set it right here at the very edge, in case you die. But yeah, so we're going to be fighting this boss, and for you guys with uh, the insect breathing, you might, are, you might have already uh, fought this boss before. I believe you need to beat her in order to... Um, actually receive your breathing just like all the other breathings where you have to defeat like a student so yeah she's fairly hard but yeah I would recommend that you guys level up to at least like 20 to 30 first um, but yeah as long as you have your QM ones uh, down you should be fine so we're gonna fight her right now and see how it goes so I'm gonna activate my god speed and yeah so cheer on she has 15, 15,000 HP, um, which is fairly, she's fairly tanky, um, so we're just gonna melt her down right here, and the reason why Shiron um, is the boss that we're farming is because, as you can see, she uh, has like the sword, the insect katana, as well as the insect haori. And on the Trello, it says that she has the highest chance of dropping the Insect Katana. Now, I'm not sure the percentage increase, but, um, I mean, it says that she has the highest chance of dropping it, so. Yeah, I would assume that, I mean, that does make sense, considering she is the Insect student. So, we're just going to finish her off pretty fast and yeah as long as you guys have your Q and your M1's down she should be fairly fairly easy so we're just gonna finish her right here yep so I didn't get any drops but yeah I got my uh, insect katana from Actually, I got mine from Kaden. I got really lucky, but yeah, statistically speaking, she has the highest drop, according to the Trell at least, um, of dropping this insect katana, which is the best katana in game as of right now. So yeah, I, I wish you guys the best of luck in getting it. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. 